YouTube, what's up? It's the boss Ella and I'm here today with a wig review and the wig that I'll be reviewing is from Eva Wigs. Eva Wigs is an online wig company and you can check them out at evawigs.com. This is the box that the wig was sent in. It comes with a wig cap. The wig is in a plastic bag like this. It comes with bobby pins. It comes with a comb, which I don't know what I did with the comb. It comes with your user manual. This is the wig that I ordered. This is a custom unit. And let me tell you a little bit about this wig. Here's the coloring that I did. All right, this wig is, this is the CEW 130 Brazilian virgin hair. The hair length is 22 inches. The color is 40% 1B and then 60% number 16. It is 130 density. There's baby hairs in the front only. This is a light brown cap. The knots are not bleached. This construction of this cap is the cap 3B. And then this is a large size cap. The lace color is light brown. This is a large cap. I usually get a medium or you can get the cap according to your size if you take your measurements. But this time I got a large cap because I don't know if my head is growing or what, but I got a larger cap. But this is the way the wig looks in the back. It has adjustable straps. It also has the lace on the nape so that you can glue this down in the back too and do an updo. There's a metal comb at the very top of the wig. Combs on the side of the wig. This is the lace up here. The knots are not bleached. Since the knots aren't bleached, I just put it on upside down. I'm going to take my powder, which is Ruby Kisses, and a brush. All right, now I'm gonna try this on without cutting the lace. I got a large cap because I want to see what that looks like. Let me show y'all the hairline. I know I got it mighty ashy with my makeup, but this is what it's looking like on the side. This is what it's looking like on the other side. I have to wipe some of that powder off there, but this is the wig. It is 22 inches long, I want to say. I want to believe. I got some light shedding already, about two strands. Okay, so I'm going to cut this lace. And then we are going to apply her and I will be right back. I have adjusted the straps kind of close to each other back there. See how long that is and how pretty maybe it is. Okay, so this is what it's looking like without gluing it down and it just sitting on my head. Y'all can see that. And I'm gonna show you these beautiful, beautiful ways in this wig. This pretty blonde color. I wish I had a went on up with the blonde color and did it like 80%. See like 80% like if the blonde had to come on up because we stopped it at 40. The black at 40 and then the blonde at 60. So you got your lace all through the wig. Almost with the way it's dyed, it looks like I have on a black hat with this blonde hair. But you can get this wig custom. You can have the blonde start where you want it to start. I should have gone on up with it, but I didn't. And this is what she is looking like. The large cap, make sure that you measure your head and know what size 
that you need to order because uh, yeah but if your cap is too large it has the adjustable straps in here but um just like right down here I know that that's just like way too long but you can always just like cut your ear out of there yeah make sure you measure it because where the combs are um, I still got like a lot of lace I can actually cut a big chunk out of that I like the large cap I mean it's on here it ain't going anywhere this is just like not really glued down I just did the front because I don't want to glue the rest of this wig because it's late at night and I just wanted y'all to see this we just got some light shedding But these curls are on point like I said I'm just not feeling how I had them do the color the color should have been higher because I look like like seriously like I have on a hat but this blonde is really pretty now it's a bit shiny if y'all can see that more shiny than I would like but it's a really soft lightweight wig her waves are beautiful you know but it's a really really cute wig really quickly I just wanted to show you guys that you can get your wigs customized the coloring customized at Eva wigs this is a wig that I chose I chose the 40 60 um, coloring with the 1B on top and then the 16 on the bottom and the main reason I got the 16 is because I like the blonde but I wanted to be able to change the color sometimes with the little temporary adore type situation you know might want to wear it pink might want to wear it green or whatever so I got this color but I like the wig the coloring though I'm wishing that I had have done uh, something a lot different like going on up with it because y'all can see how this is looking I look like I have on a black hat but it's okay uh, just be sure you know what you are talking about when you want to customize your wig at Eva Wigs okay so again this is Eva Wigs y'all go check them out to customize your color your density your wig cap and your sizing okay I will talk to y'all in the next video thank y'all for watching and you'll see this wig again because I am going to color her I'm going to color her all right so I thank y'all for watching I'll see you on the next video